Hello everyone, you're welcome. Today I'm going to share with you the five profitable businesses you can start up today in the village and benefit from them. Many people don't think that they can start up profitable businesses in the villages, but it's very possible to start up a successful business in the village. If you have a dream of starting up a business in the village, please grab your seat and watch this video to the end. Now, as we get started, don't forget to hit that like button for me so that this video reach out to everyone who need this information. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new to this channel. And the first business, guys, to start up in the village is fertilizer and seed store. Guys, if you start up this business, I'm sure you're going to grow in a short period of time. We all know that people in the village do farming for a living. And by the way, people will appreciate you for extending those services to them. They will not be going back to towns again to buy those things because you have brought them near them. So they will be saving transport and time. So guys, think about that business idea because it's a profitable and good business idea in the village. And the second business to start up in the village is a general store business. Many people travel from the village to towns to buy those small things they use in everyday life. So if you start up this business, I'm sure people are going to support you every day because they need those things, those small things they use in everyday life. They will not be going back to town again to buy them because you have extended that service to them. So if you start up that business in a village, I'm sure people will come to you every day to buy those small things they use in everyday life. They will not be going back to town to buy those things because they save transport and they save time. So guys, if you start up this business today in the village, I'm sure you're going to make good money from it because it's profitable. And the third business to start up in the village is construction material shop. Guys, if you start up a store for construction materials, you are going to make money from it because people in the village need those materials but sometimes they find a hard time to transport those materials from the town to the villages so guys if you start up that business in the village people will come to you to buy those materials as long as they are not expensive people will always come to you because they save transport and they save time so this is a good business idea to start up today in the village because people in the village build houses also and they need those materials and the fourth business you can start up in the village is watermelon farming. We all know that watermelon is among the favorite fruits for Ugandans and all people in the world. So guys, if you start up this business today of watermelon farming, I'm sure you're going to make money because people need this fruit. Watermelon has a good market, especially here in Uganda, watermelon has a good market. So if you start up watermelon farming business, you are going to make good money from it because people need them on a daily basis. What you need is to look for quality seeds and look for a good fertile soil then you start this business guys. I'm sure you're going to make good money from this business because it's a good idea. People need watermelons every day. So guys think about that business idea in the village. And the last business idea is poultry farming. Guys, this is a nice business in the village because we all know that people in the village have enough land which can make poultry farming easily. And nowadays, poultry business is on a high demand. So guys, it doesn't matter how much you have, you can start with the little you have. And later you will grow. As long as you take care of your farm, guys, you will enjoy the outcomes. Those are the business ideas you can start up in the village. But please, before starting up any business I shared, first do your own research. First do research on that business. You can consult on the people who are already in that business. You see the challenges they face so that you don't face the same challenges. Hope you guys like the ideas I shared. Please like the video and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.